Hey kids, 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 gather around, gather around, it's trash story time. Once upon a time, there was a deck, and it sucked. That's actually, uh, the whole story, yeah, uh, that's it. Yeah, the end. For those wondering about that miraculous story, what deck I'm talking about, I'm talking about red eyes. Do you have to be so insulting? Yeah, your deck is absolute horse piss. You wanna duel, smart mouth? I'll take you. Come on, let's duel. <laughs> Don't laugh. Uh, Joey, down, boy. Don't forget when you battled him before, he slaughtered you. Bro, I dropped 10 negates on your ass the last time we played. You were literally afraid to duel another match. Okay, I was afraid. Yeah, I'm the greatest player in the world. I already know that. <laughs> hey, you're right. But hey, 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 let me tell you something, Joey. Let me tell you something, Joey from Joyzy. Let me tell you something. Even though your deck sucked by itself, Red Eyes have some nice cards, bro. Red Eyes have some nice cards, bro. Red Eyes, you know what we should do, bro? Let me tell you something. Why don't we combine Red Eyes with Pendulums? Okay, anybody here got a plan? There is only one type of plan at Triff Gaming, and we stick to it. Stick to the game plan. Stick to the game plan. Stick to the game plan. That's right, baby. Me and Joey are going to be sticking to the game plan. Pendulum Red Eyes. Let's go. The Pen God meets Red Eyed God. We're going to combine our decks together, and you're going to see six interruption First turn combo, red eyes pendulums. And ain't no brick. We play 10 red eyes cards and we search every single one of them on the first turn. This deck's insane. Red eyes pendulum. We broke it on stream today. We broke it on stream by an amazing subscriber throwing in for us to break it. Come see us at the live stream, guys, every day, 10 a.m. to 1 p.m. Eastern Time. Come show. I break any deck of your choice. $20 donation. I break any deck on stream and then make a video about it later so without further ado guys go subscribe right now if you haven't already check out my beautiful true gaming play mat and this is the video enjoy greatness my friends i told you guys i told you guys red eyes six interruptions this deck is nuts this deck is so good i'm gonna show you guys right now a replay of uh, my red eyes six interruption red eyes pendulum deck and it's not like you're gonna hard draw do, 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 do. It's like you got a hard draw a good red eyes card. You simply use the pendulums to go into the guard dragon combo. You use the red eyes. You, you'll see as we go. Uh, but essentially, you're searching 10 red eyes cards. 10. Literally 10. You're ciphering through 10 red eyes cards in this combo and ending with five red eyes interruptions that have red eyes in their name and a vortex dragon. And it's really all possible by the. Pendulum cards would get you everything you want in the deck. Pendulums are the best deck ever made in history simply because you can play the amazing by themselves and they bring out the potential in every lost slash shit deck. I'm now going to show you guys greatness. Watch till the end. It is going to blow your mind. And we're also going to show you guys the deck profile at the very end as well. So, what you want to open is typically five pendulum cards. If you open five pendulum cards, you have access to the entire Red Eyes deck. And I'm going to show you guys how. Utilizing some guard dragons mainly. Because with guard dragons, what I find is if you get one Red Eyes card, the black metal dragon. And if you uh, get a little, we're going to do one more combo in the play to get more Red Eyes cards. You end up getting like five Red Eyes cards. Simply because links, uh, the link uh, zones that the pendulums monsters get you. And they make you Metaltron easily, Saryuja easily. It really makes the Guard Dragon combo so broken with Red Eyes, making Red Eyes a legitimately, legitimately tier 1 contender, not jokingly. This deck can easily, easily take care of any Salaman shit deck. Like, I would take this deck right now and destroy Salaman shit. Shout out to my stream. We are live streaming right now on my stream. So don't miss out on my other live stream. Shout out to everyone watching right now, all right? Shout out to everyone watching right now. Let's get into it. Now, Cerberus, get Jack. We're going to, the, the first part of the combo, you don't care too much about. 
simply because you guys already know this combo. It's just Pendulum playing normally. We don't ravine the Dark Crooks. We want Abductor Search. We're going to fast forward this part. It's not that important. Now, what is important is stuff like that. The Red Eyes cards. I'm going to show you guys how to get the Red Eyes combos. I don't care so much if you guys see the Pendulum combo. I want you guys to see how we get the Red Eyes cards. And how we actually end on five Red Eyes interruptions without even starting with any Red Eyes cards. Hard drawing a Red Eyes card makes it even easier. But we're going to do this combo, uh, imagine we didn't even draw it. So one of the combo we end on is Lord of the Red. Uh, the Red Eyes Ritual that not many of you know about, but it is amazing. Uh, once per turn during either player's turn, when a card or effect's activated, you can target one monster on the field, destroy it. And the same thing goes for spell, uh, when a, any card or effect activated, you destroy spell or trap. So you get two pops from this card, and they're not, it's not a hard one per turn, you can use them both. Now, if you'd rather in your deck because you search it out in the combo, but... If you discard it, the combo, you can still get it to your hand from the combo. So it doesn't matter. So we're going to keep going in our combo here. At this point, if Electrum got hand trapped, if Pencall got hand trapped, it didn't matter. You had a good enough hand to play through it. So even through a hand trap, you're still putting up a nasty, nasty board. Now, we keep going here. Uh, we're going to... The line of play here, you do want to summon a Harmonizing Magician and two level sixes to make sure the combo goes off. And we draw Red Eyes, uh, Darkness Flare Metal. This makes the combo even easier. We don't need to draw it again. Any of those two red eyes cards we drew, we don't need to draw them. But if you draw them, it just makes the combo easier. Uh, but we're going to play as if we didn't even draw them. Just to show you guys that any combo can do it. Uh, we would, our lineup play would be a little bit different if we didn't hard draw them. Or sorry, if we did hard draw them and we like, were playing in a tournament. But we don't care so much for that. Another shout out to my boys out here. And this deck was actually requested, as I said in the beginning of the intro, from Chris Burns. Uh, you have a $20 deck request, which you do on our streams. Uh, the first two deck requests on the channel are going to be honored. And we're going to do two deck requests every single stream. And this is one of them. So, as you see here, we summon two sixes, two uh, Harmony Magician, if I bring out another Magician, and a Dark Worm. That's what's needed for the combo. Uh, different variations of it. Dark Worm could be any Dragon. Uh, dragon Caller could be the skill. That, we took out Dragon Caller. Never mind. Dra dark Worm could be any Dragon. Any two sixes, any two uh, Magicians. So, here we go into Beatrice. And Beatrice is going to send, this is the main part of the combo, a very important part of the combo, which is going to send Pre-Preparation of Rites, which is going to get you Lord of Red and uh, the Red Eyes Ritual spell to be able to summon it. Uh, one thing to know is Pre-Preparation of Rites can even add it from the graveyard if you hard draw it. So keep that in mind. Uh, Elevian Paladin here is going to search it. Before we did this combo with Soul Charge, but now Soul Charge is bad. And Pre-Preparation of Rites is so good with the Red Eyes Lord of Red that... Uh, it's worth playing with Alignment Paladin. Now, we're going to save that in our hand, the Pre-Preparation of Rites, but eventually we're going to add it. Now, Dark Room at this point will go into LP, and LP is going to bring out one of the most broken cards, and one of the most amazing, amazing cards uh, that I honestly recommend all you guys play uh, in any Guard Dragon deck, simply because of this. Uh, Black Metal Dragon. If this card set from the field to the grave, add one Red Eyes card from your deck to your hand. Which will then add the Red Eyes Darkness Metal. And then the Pisty will bring this back. And then the Darkness Metal will bring it back. Giving you multiple, multiple, multiple Red Eyes adds in one turn. Which you can easily do in Pendulums every turn. And I know Red Eyes itself can do it sometimes. Not super consist consistent though. The pure Red Eyes deck I think is absolute shit. But when you mix it with Pendulums. Offers you a whole other level of power. Now we're going to keep going here. We're going to go Pisty. And we're going to add Red Eyes Insight, which is going to allow us to send. At this point, we send, uh, so we have Transmigration, and Red Eyes is going to send. So Red Eyes Insight, one sec. So Red Eyes Insight uh, lets you send any Red Eyes monster from behind your deck to the grave. When you activate it to add a Red Eyes spell, just keep that in mind. We, oh, there we activate Preparation of Rights to add Transmigration and Lord of Red. At this point, we send Red Eyes Black Dragon. Uh, in the uh, later deck profile, I'll show you guys, we don't play Red Eyes Black Dragon anymore. We play uh, the level 8 Red Eyes just to uh, be able to get a one card. Uh, tr transmigrate, uh, the Ritual spell, what it does is you can banish any Red Eyes from your graveyard to special Red Eyes, like Ritual from your hand, or any mods and or any monsters. So if you didn't have the level 8 Red Eyes, you can summon any other monster. But simply if we sent the level 8 instead, uh, we, it's a one card Lord of Red. But we're going to have to banish Abductor from hand. We could have kept Abductor. Uh, keep that in mind. So we could have uh, had another plus card at the end. And we Red Eyes Insight adds Red Eyes Fangwood Chain. For those of you who don't know what Red Eyes Fangwood Chain does, very simply, Alkahest. Uh, when you target it to a Red Eyes monster, steal a uh, steal a monster that your opponent controls. 
And we're gonna get three of this card in this combo. So this combo are just three Alkahests very easily. Like the hand wasn't broken that we started with, it's just an average hand. And if anything got hand trap, we still had this. Like we have so much blessing that it didn't even matter. Next, we're gonna go with the Pain. We're gonna search again another Fangwa Chain. Uh, one thing to note is this build, we only had two Fangwa Chain. We learned after we needed to play three. So we're proxying the third one. And in the com in the deck football later, we have three. That's very important. And they don't brick. Because if you hard draw it, you're always gonna resolve it anyways with the guard dragon combo. And if they're gonna hand trap something, they're hand trapping the electrum. The uh the guard dragons are not getting hand trapped, electrum's getting hand trapped. So you don't have to worry about the guard dragons getting hand trapped. If you get that far where your guard dragons are coming down, you're not getting hand trapped. Bring out the vortex now with agar with agar pain before red md is gonna banish the lp bring out the uh, metal dragon and then we're gonna link all those three away into saryuja uh now so you're just only gonna get a special summon effect and we're gonna get another add at this point we're gonna proxy the pendulum card we're gonna add that card right there the pendulum card right there is the trap card it's a proxy for red eyes fang with chain so at this point we have three red eyes fang with chain three alka hests it literally uh target one of these Steal a, a monster opponent controls. We got a vortex. Now we're gonna have to put up one more negate. We're gonna uh, special abductor with Sage's effect, even though uh, at this point we had the level eight, it would have been easier. And we're gonna banish both of them and bring out the Lord of Red. We don't we didn't need the abductor in our hand. Uh, simply, if we sent the level eight as we should have with the red eyes, we'd add a one card Lord of Red. And Lord of Red is two interruptions in itself. The pendulum call, don't forget, is the red eyes fang with chain, which is absolutely busted. Talk about it as monster control. At one point, you can attack two times per battle phase. Not that important, but you can send this equipment card to the graveyard. Target one effect monster your opponent on the field. Equip it to this card. So any effect monster your opponent controls, equip it to uh, the Red Eyes Dark Tips Metal, uh, making him literally, uh, making your, like, just steal three monster your opponent controls. Not a hard once per turn. Absolutely broken. Absolutely broken. So we set three there, and three interruptions from Red Eyes Fangwood Chain. Two with Lord of Red, because that's two interruptions in itself. A Vortex, and an incredible follow-up in a Distrudo. Harmonizing that you're gonna get back from an Oak Dragon. Uh, Black Fang, which you're gonna get from uh, Jackal's gonna come out. Harmonizing, you're gonna get back. Dark Tears Metal's gonna bring back something else. And uh, one thing to note if you didn't open Pen Call, uh, this would end on another negate uh, with uh, the start you to the fact to add the attack, uh, the attack boost or to special summon the Doctor, either to bring out the Lord of Red or whatever. Uh, it's gonna trigger Lord of Red to pop, even when your opponent controls, and then to pop your Black Fang and special out the Jackal. But you had Pen Call, so you can't do that. So just like that, one, two, three, four, five, six. Negate one, two, three, four, five, six interruptions. Vortex just there to stop evenly matched, and then five interruptions to destroy your opponent. Red eyes pendulums broken. Now, I'm gonna show you guys the deck profile super quick. You guys saw it, man. You guys saw it. That deck was broken, and with red eyes, what yo, Joey did Joey Wheeler? Did I do you proud? I hope I did you proud, Joey. This is the deck profile. We're gonna go through it super quick. You search all 10 of these red eyes cards in this pendulum combo with, uh, it's amazing. Like Black Metal Dragon, very simply, you get it with LP, Pisty, and uh, uh, Red Eyes Darkness Metal. You get it to like three times, all three times getting uh, the Red Eyes Fangle Chain or this. So if you if you draw one of them, you get all three. If not, you get two. Broken. Uh, this this should have, in the combo, you guys saw the Red Eyes Black Dragon for Sauce. We threw that one in there. Uh, we're going to get to the rest of this video. Shout out to my chat. I am doing a live stream right now. So shout out to Triff Nation. We do live streams every single day. Someone requested a twenty dollar deck profile to break red red eyes, and we did six interruption red eyes pendulums. We did. So shout out to my stream, the best stream in the world. I love you guys. Look at this. Look at this. This is the best comment right here. Red eyes best deck twenty negates every hand. Damn right. Red eyes. 20 negates every hand through any hand drop. Let's go. That's the deck, bro. It's too good. Let's go. Shout out, chat. Shout out, chat, baby. So you guys want to come through your streams, you should come through to them. We stream every day, 10 a.m. to 1 p.m. Eastern time, every single day. So shout out, Triff Nation. I love all you guys, man. I really, really do. Uh, we, we break two videos every single day. Uh, the first two to donate get it that day. We were like, we're backed up with these. We're gonna, like the next like week almost is taken up with videos. But do swing by. We break any deck of your choice. Uh, we broke Magnet Warriors, Insectors, uh, Cubics, Red Eyes, uh, Phantom Light Nerlius, uh, Phantom Chaos Nerlius, 
uh, broken decks. The bro shit decks we made broken. All these cards are five, six interruptions. Add Magnet Warriors, if I didn't mention it. Like, all these like bad decks made amazing. Uh, Nef uh, Mephthys, whatever the fuck. Anyways, uh, Metaphys. And I'm going to keep going here. Three, uh, one Red Eyes Insight, what it does, you send this, you send Red Eyes Darkness Dragon, making Lord of Red a one card way to summon it. And you search these in the combo, get a Lord of Red. And three, Red Eyes Fangle Chain, which is an Alkahest. Literally three Alkahests, which you search in the combo. You send pre Prepermission Rise with Beatrice. And uh, that uh, Enlightenment Paladin adds it back to get both of these. Lord of Red is two interruptions in its own. So you search all ten of these Red Eyes cards in turn one very easily. So a pure Red Eyes deck puts up two Red Eyes cards in the first turn and passes. But we don't do that. What we do is we uh, put up every single Pendulum card in the game and uh, add all these amazing Red Eyes cards. All right, shout out again, my beautiful chat. I love you guys. Um, next, every single Turbo card, 21 Commandments, all these 21. Not debatable. Every Pendulum deck needs to play them. Triple Pen Call, again, not debatable. Six, three Harm, one, three Wisdom, not debatable. These... 33 cards are not to be on any pendulum deck. Every pendulum deck in the world must play 60 regardless of what version you're playing. I don't care. Now we do play Triple Oath only because it's a pseudo. Something I might be testing in the future is Triple Oath moving forward. No matter the deck. Simply because it's a pseudo Wisdom Eye. And if you draw that in conjunction with any pendulum, uh, even if it's a purple poison, you can simply add a, a send a Harmo, add it, Electro pop to poison. And if they don't hand trap the Electro, they don't have a, they don't have a hand trap. Uh, so if you, they're not going to save the Veiler or something. So if you activate poison, you're not going to be locked into your scales. So, Ope is a pseudo Wisdom Eye in that sense. And Wisdom Eye is unbelievable. It ensures you get harmonizing every turn. Big brain trip right there. We play Double Black Fang because uh, this combo, if you don't have... Jackal is usually the level 6 you have to go into Beatrice with. So, Jackal is always in the graveyard. So, uh, Lord of Red lets you pop a card for free on your turn, utilizing Sayuja's effect, uh, which I'll show, you, I'll show you guys in the combo. And uh, Black Fang will bring out a free Jackal. We don't play anything else. Pro Poison sucks. We don't play anything else. Uh, if you really want, you can take a one more ult, but in this deck, you play three. In normal, you play one, and like one Fang, one Pit, whatever. You don't need to play Pit, because you want Fang as this part, because Lord of Red will pop it, and special the Jackal. Normal Pendulum, you don't have the Jackal in Graveyard, but this version does, so it's good. One get a triple Dark Orb, you always want it for, for uh, the Dragon plays. One get zero double Jackal. One Distrudo, because you play nine ways to go into it. We don't play Mirror Mirror. Uh, we could if we want, but... We don't want to play more non-pendulums. This is a very good deck. It doesn't break whatsoever. If you draw any of the red eyes, it's good. Uh, it makes your combo even easier. Uh, triple lure one upstart. You need more spells for abductor. And like I said, if you draw any of the red eyes cards, it makes your combo even easier. They don't break whatsoever at all. Like, we drew two red eyes cards in this combo. We still did it. So it doesn't break. Uh, every hand does uh, that amazing combo. Extra deck, Electrum, Beatrice, Elena Paladin, uh, Pisty, uh, LP, and Agar Pain. All of some, you need them all. Uh... Metal Trunk Double Sayuja, you need it. Their arrows help you with all uh, resolving Pisty, Agar Pain, and LP. Uh, Vortex, that's you don't play with Absolute. Agar Pain brings up the Vortex. And then just going second cards. Uh, the Phoenix, the Unicorn, the Bull Sword. Those will only go second cards you need, to be honest. We'll be siding in the Mare Mare Engine, Mare Mare Yazi, Link Rebo, Boral Load as well with the uh, Brio. We'll be siding that. We didn't make a side deck for this deck. And uh, one Boral Savage, for another Free Negate with Harmo Wisdom. Sometimes you can do it. And a Dragster with the Destrudo, which you can do many, many times. That's a deck. Uh, do check out my streams, guys. We break these decks live in front of everyone, uh, no matter how long it takes. Uh, the deck's amazing. Uh, we spent a lot of effort on it. Uh, every other deck we made, we break. So, guys, subscribe. Honestly, we're at 15,000 subscribers. hit 16,000 ASAP. And uh, do check out my streams, and we could uh, break any deck of your choice. Hope you guys like this video. See you guys in the next video. Peace.